Welcome to Thomas and Friends Adventures! Italy! Ciao means both hello and goodbye in Italian. Now, you try saying it. Ciao! I was so proud. At last, I had made a great discovery. The great... Let's race! Three, two, one, go! Pasta! Tap the boost button to zoom ahead! We can do this! Don't be late! Faster than the speed of light! Pasta! I've visited many countries and seen lots of amazing places. When I first arrived in Italy, I felt as if I had to know everything about its rich history. I pretended to be an expert in archaeology, but I soon learned that I didn't know everything. I even got myself into a dangerous situation. It's okay not to know everything when you're somewhere new. The best way to learn is simply to ask questions. The piano was invented by an Italian named Bartolomeo Cristofori. As I was about to leave, Stefano told me the story of the lost engine, who was also a curious engine like me. The lost engine was always on the lookout for adventure, but one day he simply vanished and no... Three, two, one, go! Splendid! Tap the boost button to zoom ahead! Marvelous! Let's go! 
Thomas was so caught up in his story, he took a wrong turn. He ended up in an old abandoned mine. I called out for help. To my surprise. Lorenzo was telling me how he got there when rocks started falling on the ground, blocking the entrance. We had to get out quickly before the mines collapsed. So we pushed on through the tunnels to find a way out. We couldn't stop in time to avoid crashing through the wooden barrier. We found ourselves hanging from a cliff over the sea. Stefano was more than surprised. Mamma mia, he said. What's going on here? We were so lucky. Stefano used his crane to rescue us. You should have seen the look on his face when he saw Lorenzo. The last engine wasn't lost anymore. Thomas! Where is Thomas? <laughs> Thomas and Gina were working on the Italian railway. She was really passionate about Italy's rich culture. She found it... Amazing job! Gina was teasing me. I didn't like it. I needed to prove to her that I could be an archaeo... What a great construction! Well done! 